Hello friends, I have come up with yet another video. This time uh, I'm focusing on the important questions for your second internal examination. That's for a uh, green building technology. So I have come up with uh, nine questions. And as you're aware that uh, you need to be writing uh, three short answer questions and you need to attempt two long answer questions out of three. But uh, I'm giving you a total of nine questions, five uh, short answer questions and four long answer questions. Now, you need to put in at least that much amount of effort in order to prepare for the internal examination. So uh, first of all, uh, I would like uh, to request you all to prepare thoroughly for the second mid examination. And as you know that uh, time is fast approaching by for your session and examination as well. Now, this is, uh, this is an elective uh, subject and uh, I hope you should be able to get through it very easily. And uh, just because it's an elective uh, doesn't um, make the relevance of the subject less. Okay, it is very important. Green building technology is very important from, from today's uh, scenario because uh, we are falling short of uh, you know the non-renewable fuels like coal and petroleum. So there is an increasing need of uh, you know the technology related to green building, and you would come across uh, such buildings in the near future. And there is a growing demand for this, okay? Uh, very soon, uh, you should be finding uh, green buildings uh, in every nook and corner of your place. And then uh, you already have so many electric vehicles, okay? So there is a lot of emphasis on green technologies, green solutions, okay? There's less usage of paper and uh, more, uh, you know, soft copies preferred rather than the hard, uh, hard copy and, you know, this way we are, you know, um, you know, we are just putting a break on cutting down of trees. Okay. So uh, overall, you know, we are trying to save the environment by, uh, you know, adopting the green building technology. Okay. So coming to, coming back to questions here. So the questions, as you can see here, just a minute, um, you know, I'll be sharing the screen with you all. Give me a moment before I can do that. So I'm sharing the screen with you. I hope you can see this. Okay, uh, now uh, let me just delete for this, uh, whatever you can see on the screen there. Okay, now the first question is, write short notes on wind and solar energy harvesting as methods to reduce operational energy. Okay, this is the first question. The second question would be, write a note on zero ozone depleting potential substances. Okay, and finally, uh, I mean, there are three more questions, I'm sorry. So the third question is, differentiate between zero energy building and green building. Okay, coming back, uh, coming to fourth question, uh, how separation of household waste is carried out in green buildings? Now comes the fifth question, write short note on low VOC paints and daylighting. Okay, please make sure VOC is in caps. Okay, it's an abbreviation for volatile uh, organic content. Okay. So I have dictated the first five short answer questions. Out of this, you can expect three in your internal two. Okay. Now, coming to long answer questions. The first question is, what are the various impacts of building construction on environment? Okay, coming to second question, explain any five building materials helpful in reducing embodied energy of building. Okay, and then you have the third question, that is how can the embodied energy be reduced in buildings? And the fourth question, the final question in LAQ, describe the various methods to maintain indoor air 
slash environmental quality. Okay, so, uh, you know, both are not same. I mean, indoor air quality and indoor environmental quality are not the same, but uh, you can write the answer for indoor environmental quality as far as your internal exam two is concerned. Okay, so actually, uh, I made a small mistake uh, instead of uh, environmental, I should have, um, instead of air, I should have written environmental. Okay, but just you can write the answer for indoor environmental quality. Okay, all the answers are contained uh, in the PDF notes, which I have already sent to you. Okay, still, if you have any doubts, you can always contact me. I can just uh, tell you the relevant portions uh, in the PDF, which would help you to get the answer. Okay, moreover, you can also do your homework by browsing over the internet. Okay, uh, I have not, uh, you know, proposed or recommended any textbook because uh, that information would be too much for you. Okay, it, it would go beyond the scope of the subject. Okay, but anyways, whatsoever, uh, please don't take this uh, subject lightly, thinking that, uh, you know, it's an elective after all, and uh, you would simply, you know, pass through. Of course, I, I, you have the best wishes from me. Um, I would like each one of you to clear this exam with flying colors, okay? It's not just pass, I'm expecting outstanding grade, okay? So this is it from me. And uh, yeah, just make sure that these are the nine questions for your assignment too as well, okay? So prepare, uh, you know, write them accordingly and uh, submit them at the earliest. Uh, it would be still okay if you can uh, submit assignment two immediately after uh, your internal examination. But please make sure that you do submit in time because uh, then I would have to uh, be preparing the mark sheet and I need to finalize the marks, okay? And again, uh, I would like to also request you that uh, I'm trying to put in the best efforts possible to create YouTube videos, okay, which are helpful to you, okay? So if you find them helpful, please do, uh, you know, like and subscribe the channel, okay? Uh, and uh, turn on the bell notifications so that uh, whenever I upload any new video, you get the information, you get notifications and you can watch them. Okay. So that's it for me. Okay. Please make sure that you submit the assignment with these nine questions, uh, you know, soon after the internal exam too. Okay. I would also like to, you know, upload a soft copy of these questions, but otherwise, uh, you know, I think um, you can just go through, uh, you should be able to, you know, type down the questions. Okay, and get the relevant answers. Okay, uh, best of luck for internal two and also the session exam session and examinations. Uh, uh, I would like to have at least a one final class with you all. Okay, so that I can give you tips on how to write the examination. Okay, just uh, I have been to uh, you know I have been evaluating papers, so I know what are the things that we look for as far as the answers are concerned. So make sure uh, that you adopt those tips. Okay, write in good handwriting. Okay, good presentations side headings, underlining, okay? Neat handwriting, neat presentation always makes a very good impression, okay? We, uh, it's not possible, you know, when we evaluate to, you know, probably read each and every sentence and focus on every word, because that way we can't be covering so many papers, right? So just make sure that you follow certain tips, okay? Write the exams well, okay? And remember me in your prayers, right? Okay, that's it for me.